The following video is brought to you by Yellow Jacket. Visit yellowjacket.com to find out why Yellow Jacket is the industry standard in refrigerant hoses, tools, manifolds, and vacuum pumps, and many other tools. All right, guys, we got a no cool call on a carrier. Fan spinning real slow and no compressor. And they said sometimes the fan will start, sometimes it won't. I bet you we got a bad capacitator. I got a 16 sear three ton from 2012. Got the Chinese capacitor on there. All right, we got a 45 slash five. For video purposes, I have the alligator clamp on common. We'll go to Hermatic. Yep, 8.4. Go to fan. Yep. Easy enough. We'll go get one off the truck. All right. I knew I had one on the truck, but I was glad to see that I had a, a skinny round one because most of the 45.5s now are bigger around and they don't fit in the carrier ICP bracket. But I had one that'll fit in here. Sometimes you gotta, a lot of guys will just if they don't have a the correct one, they'll just take this bracket off right here. And they'll throw it away. And they'll leave the they'll put the capacitor in the box like so. And just leave it like that. Now if I wouldn't have had a small one, I would have made me a bracket with uh, some I call it plumbing strap. It's the, the strapping with the holes in it. Some people call it different things, but I was always brought up, we called it plumbing strap. Okay, we got it to fit in there. Always try to put it where you can see the size without having to take the bracket apart. There's common. It's our fan. And blue is hermetic on carrier. All right, she ought to run now. That's better. That's just the camera that makes the motor look like that, guys. So, Let's check our amp draws. Point 0.5. On about a point five on the money. Put 
compressor 14.1 8.5 all right guys it's 410a got the carrier pure on sticker there almost 150 pounds of suction a little over 300 on the head nothing nothing there to alarm me Again, like I said on the last video, y'all can debate my little stub gauge method here. But I'm on a capacitor change out. I had no indication that the refrigerant charge is messed up. So this does fine. It's never failed me. I love my little stub gauges. All right, guys, I'll button her back up and they should be good to go. All right, guys, that one was easy enough. The old carrier. Lives to fight another day. Alright guys, thanks for watching. We'll see y'all on the next one.